Hey everyone, Outer here with some late breaking news. Uh, it is confirmed there is Russian troops on the ground inside of Kazakhstan. So if those of you who don't believe that something's going to pop off in Ukraine, Russia's already got active troops killing people right now. I mean, this is crazy. They are literally shooting at protesters. We're not being told the full story of this. Um, this video right here, I'm going to leave the link at the bottom. Like always, you guys can check it out. Rapid gunfire. I mean, rapid gunfire. Like, this is no joke, okay? And Belarus is there, as well as Armenia, and their uh, whole little pack that they have, the uh, C uh, uh, C S T O, I believe it's called. And this pack was, was founded a while back, and... I believe that this is kind of interesting because it's kind of like Russia's own like little NATO, and it shows an alliance between these these nations, and the Russian troops are being called Russian peacekeepers, and the government there, a lot of the officials have stepped down from power, so this is going to leave a vacuum for Russia to suck up, which is what Russia wants to do anyway. So Russia's going to probably seize control of the most uranium-rich nation in the world that produces the most uranium right before World War and invade Ukraine. So this is getting very interesting, folks, and uh, that's the reason why I believe Putin told the, uh, the White House that they want a deal immediately, like now, because Russia loves to fight wars in the wintertime, folks. It's to be the perfect time for them to do what they need to do. So just be ready, because it's already popping off in Kazakhstan, you know? What a way to start off 2020. Here we are. Entering into a possible world war, folks. So, just uh, wanted to give you guys this update. Update. Um, it's not just uh, um, regular old uh, um, combat troops that are on the ground. That uh, they got paratroopers parachuting in and flying in, and it's just crazy. I mean, it's just nuts what's happening. So, you know, a lot of crazy stuff going on, folks. We're gonna keep an eye on this as always. They say dozens of protesters are dead and and a couple police officers. Um, they say it's because of the fuel fuel prices, but we know that that's just BS. Um, it could be a number of things. It could be because nobody wants to live under tyranny anymore and they're tired of all this. And it could also be because people are just, uh, there could be some sort of political um, uh, subgroups that are being activated to seed and, and sow chaos in the region for there to be a takeover. It could be the United States that's done this. Russia could have done it themselves to seize control of the uranium. There could be a number of things that are happening right now that we just don't know about. Remember, Hitler took over, um, what was it? Was it? Took over Poland. 